Hi, I'm Chris Gillis, LCMS Product Manager for Shimazu Scientific Instruments. In this video, I'll be showing you how easy it is to change the desolvation line or inlet capillary on a Shimazu mass spectrometer. You'll see that it is not necessary to vent the instrument in order to accomplish this procedure. For this procedure, you can also refer to section 7.9 in the LCMS instruction manual. You will need a five millimeter hex wrench, a drawing tool, and a replacement desolvation line DL assembly. Note, be sure to match the correct DL assembly with your mass spec model. After turning off all gas flows and heaters in the lab solution software, remove the LC connection tubing. Unlock and remove the ionization unit. To avoid injury, the temperature of the heated block should be below 50 degrees Celsius before you remove the unit. Using the hex wrench, loosen both bolts on the front of the heater flange. The bolts have a capture mechanism, so you cannot completely remove them from the flange. Using the drawing tool, remove the heater flange. Insert the drawing tool behind the heat block and pull the heater flange straight out. Once the flange has been removed, set it aside on a clean surface. Disconnect the DL temperature sensor plug on the left side of the desolvation line. Squeeze the plug to unlock it. Using the same hex wrench, loosen the two locking bolts holding the desolvation line in place. The bolts should not be removed completely, only loosened. Rotate the DL assembly clockwise and remove it from the mass spectrometer. Insert a new DL assembly in the direction shown. Note that the special design of the orifice maintains vacuum during this procedure. Rotate the new DL counterclockwise. Ensure that the connector plates engage behind the two bolts. Using the hex wrench, securely tighten both bolts. Reconnect the DL temperature sensor plug. Mount the heater flange in place. Use the guide at the top of the flange to help with alignment. Keep it straight as you push it into place. Finger tighten the bolts, then use the wrench to secure the heater flange. Be careful not to over tighten. Reattach the ionization unit and lock it in place. Reconnect the LC tubing and initiate the heaters and gas flows. For more information about Shimazu mass spectrometers, visit us at www.ssi.shimazu.com. Excellence in science. Shimazu.